That is absolutely gorgeous. It's Lickily Live on KEXP, the new album, I Never Learn. It's absolutely stunning. And it's a very densely layered album, and there's a lot of emotion in it. And you have evolved over the evolution of your albums, and that's to be expected from an artist who's stretching their creative wings and sort of learning as you go along over the years. Tell me a little bit about what you were thinking about when you went into the studio. What were you wanting to experiment with? And did you try any new instrumentation or something different? I think uh, what I wanted to do was just to get, you know, I wanted to peel back. I wanted to get straight to the core and have it all about um, the song and the message and the voice and not hide behind anything and, and be real honest and naked and bare. It does feel like a very honest and naked and bare album, as you say. The lyrics are really potent, and they're just right out there on the top of it. Is it, it how does it feel performing those? Do you sort of relive the intensity of those every time? I do, actually, and it kind of also now that I've, you know, I've kind of come out on the other side, I realize how <laughs> deep I was in. You know, I wasn't quite a lot of pain when I wrote it and and it's shocking sometimes to sing it now. Does it feel healing to move through that sort of on a daily basis at this point while you're performing? Yeah it's a beautiful thing I think yeah. Well the album is absolutely beautiful and the emotion just right there so visceral in the songs. Can you play another for us? Sure I'm gonna play No Rest for the Wicked.
so lovely. It's Licky Lee live on KEXP tonight, playing an all ages free in store at Sonic Boom Records in Ballard. That's at 7 p.m. tonight. It's great to get the kids out. Yeah, to, man. To see live music. I know that you have worked with Bjorn Yitling, um, a Peter Bjorn and John, on all of your albums. Mm -hmm. And I imagine that you've built up quite a level of trust over the many years of working together and friendship. Mm -hmm. What is the process like? Has it changed over the years and with each album? It's changed a lot because I met him when I was 19 and now I'm 28. So it's almost like I went from being a brat and into almost becoming a woman. Um, and it's not like we're friends, you know? It's more of a, um, what do you say? dysfunctional marriage probably <laughs> you can't live without it yet you can't live with it but um he's a wonderful amazing man and songwriter and is he how, how involved is he i imagine it must be a really rewarding process if you keep going back album after album does it change the way that you work together is he actually performing on the album or is he just behind the scenes i mean this time i told him i want to produce this album so um, you have to take a step back. So I guess on this record, he was, you know, we wrote the songs and then, you know, he's like, all right, you want to produce? I'll, you know, <laughs> I'll let you produce. So I kind of had to, you know, steer the ship on this one, which was wonderful, but also challenging. Well, you need to keep doing that because this album is amazing. I have Thank loved you. all your albums and they're all quite different, which yeah. is really exciting as a fan of your music. Mm. Where did you record the record? I recorded it um, in Los Angeles and in Stockholm. And I've heard that, are you living in Los Angeles now? Or I were was. You for a time? I was, yeah, for two and a half years. And now I'm kind of vagabonding. I'm living out of a suitcase. So, But I'll go back. Yeah. Um, I, it sounds like your band is from Sweden. Yeah. Do you want to say hello to them and introduce them to our listeners? Yeah. We have Anders Stenberg on guitar. We have... Micke Svensson on piano, and we have Lars Skoglund on drums. We have Anders Pettersson on pedal steel. We have Kiki Halmos on vocals. You all sound wonderful together. They're Thank you best. so much for coming in today. Licky Lee is live in studio here at KEXP, and if we're lucky, she'll play another song. Never gonna love again. Baby, can you hear the rain fall coming? Never gonna love again. Baby, can you hear my heart cry and I can't keep running away. This time. 
Lickily Live on KEXP. That's so powerful. All of the songs on the record are each element, the vocals, the lyrics, the music are all just dripping with emotion. Well done. Thank you. You've also released, uh, at least so far, I've seen a couple of videos. And I know in the past you've been very involved mm -hmm. in the creative process and the videos. Do you still get your fingers in there? Yeah, more than ever. Yeah, absolutely. I also heard, speaking of someone who just can't sit still creatively, that you recently acted in a Swedish crime thriller that I think it, I read that it was just very recently released. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, so that was Tariq Saleh, who I've done a lot of the videos with, who directed that one, and it's a Swedish um, film noir, maybe you would say. Um, and I have one of the parts in it, and yeah, I don't know what to say, it was amazing. D is that something you want to do more of? If I get the chance to, to tell a story that's worth telling, yeah. That sounds great. I hope I get a chance to see that. Do you know if it has a wide release? I don't know. I know that it's going around in Europe, but I'm not sure if it's coming to America or not. But it's called Tommy, right? Tommy, yeah. So we can keep an eye out for yeah, that. Please. Hopefully there'll be a way to get a hold of that. Uh, I know you're in town right now. We thank you so much for making thank time you. today. You're playing at Sonic Boom tonight. Mm -hmm. Do you, What do you have planned in terms of touring? I'll be, what am I playing this summer in America? I'll play Lollapalooza, Outside Lands, um, and then I'm coming back in the fall as well for a nationwide tour. I'm so happy that you're getting your music out there. I know, though, after your first album, you toured for something like three years straight. Yeah. And I remember reading an interview that kind of made me sad because it said that when you came off tour, you had trouble reintegrating in life because all you knew was years and years of playing a show, driving to the next show. And I'm wondering if you found a way as you've gotten older to kind of balance, you know, living a full life every day <laughs> that allows you to get back into it after mm. touring. Kind of not. I mean, I get to pretend I do for a couple of months and then here I am again. You it's know, I never learn. Still figuring it out. Yeah. <laughs> That's sort of the theme of your album. Exact of my life. Yeah. But it, I am so happy that you'll be out there sharing the songs with an audience. I'm happy too. The album I Never Learn, it's Licky Lee live on KEXP with one last song. Ben Shot.
so beautiful. Thank you so much. Licky Lee live on KEXP tonight at Sonic Boom Records in Seattle at 7 p.m. And that's free in all ages. I Never Learn is the new album, and we look forward to seeing you again. Thank you. Thank you so much. You've got it tuned to KEXP Seattle.